So you said I'm like 23 weeks, so like... That's about six months. About, okay. Yeah, so I mean, like, is it um, like, is it like pretty big? Like, do you know how big it is? Like... It's six months. It's, uh, it's fully like, grown. It's fully grown? Yeah. Okay. So um, you mean it has like all the parts and stuff? You yeah. Think? Okay. Yeah. So how are they... How, how do they like remove it then? It's done by suction. It's a sucking tube that it, they just hold and it sucks it in, and then they put it in a in a solution and they send it out to the lab uh -huh. so they can measure everything to make sure that everything came out of you. Oh, okay. So it doesn't like come out because you said it's like kind of developed. It doesn't come out like one piece. No. Like. Okay. So how, I'm just trying to think. How does it? They start. Oh, okay. Falling apart. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. Just do it. Yeah. <laughs> like, what if it was, like, twitching or, like, something like that? Like? The, the solution will make it stop. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's not going to be moving around in the jar. Okay, the solution would make it, like... Yeah. That's the whole purpose of the solution. Okay. So, like, if it, if it looked like it was, like like breathing or something like that it'll automatically stop it won't be able to it won't be a okay so i'm not even gonna see it no so okay so i mean like if that happens sleep they take it out and it goes into our lab where they do the stuff with the jar and cleaning and all that okay so what is the solution it's just like something like toxic or something yeah okay <laughs> we have to so do like that to keep it clean and you know, because by the time it gets to the lab, it still needs to be freshly, you know. Yeah. So so they could weigh it, so it could be proper weight to make sure that everything came out of you. Like, there's no pieces left in you. Right? So, like, you'll make sure, like, I don't have to deal with it. No. It's, it will die. Like You're done. You're done. Once you start this today, that's it. You'll, you're not going to see it. We're not going to show you your sonogram pictures. We're not going to... You know. Yeah. All right. So I'm like, if I feel like I'm having like labor pain kind of thing. Yeah. Call us. Call you. Yeah. We have an emergency line. Like, what if it like pops out like at home? Yeah. Like, <laughs> if it comes out. Yeah. Then it comes out. Then flush it, comes, it. Just like flush it. Yeah. But you still have to come in. Okay. We have to make sure that it, everything came out. But we never had a situation like that. Because if it's like, what if it's like on the floor? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, what would we yeah, do with it? Yeah, we're not going to be taking care of it. That's what I'm then saying. <laughs> like, you guys would come yes, and, like... if anything, you know, we'll tell you to put it in a bag or something or in somewhere and bring it to us. And then we have two different procedures all the time. You do? It's, like, pretty common. Like, yeah. even with me kind of stage. Yeah. Like, at this stage. Like, every day. Whatever happens at home, you know, like, don't call the hospital. No. No. Call us. Okay. okay. Why? So why not call we, the hospital? Because like, we started it first. Um, the hospital won't take you, they won't touch you either because we started it. So whoever starts it has to finish it. They would force me to have it? They might, or they might just tell you to push it out. Really? Yeah, like Kings County tells patients to push out the pregnancy. When it's not, when it's alive? Mm-hmm. When you're this far along, they yeah. tell them to push it out. Even if it's like, even, and then it comes out alive? Yeah. And then I don't know what they do with it. 